Hello everyone, I'm Sanjay Gupta. I welcome you on Sanjay Gupta Tech School. In this video, I am going to demonstrate a scenario based on scheduled triggered flow. Let's understand the requirement so that we can implement a scheduled triggered flow. So the requirement says we need to update case records on weekly basis. So we need to update those case records where case origin is web. And uh, we need to put this email in the web email field on cases. So I'm jumping to create a flow. So before that, if I open any case record, so here you can see we have uh, case origin. So case origin is having phone email web. So if it, if it is web, so in this web email, we need to put that email ID, right? So what I need to do, I'm moving here and selecting all open cases. So I'm just going to configure this list view. So I'm just adding case origin and web email field in the list view. So here you can see a case origin is available and web is available, right? So now I can create scheduled triggered flow so that we can see whether uh, this is working fine or not. So in scheduled triggered flow, we need to set a uh, date and time. So for that, what you can do, just open any of the case record and uh, do some changes. So let's say I'm changing the status. So from here, last modified date and time, you can see the current date and time. So I'm going to select the date as 4th of July. Here time is 10.23. So here I'm selecting Ten thirty p.m. Frequency. I am selecting weekly because, as per the requirement, we need to run this flow on weekly basis. Now, uh, selection of this object and the criteria is optional. So I am just leaving it as is, and I am going to select this update record. So we need to update cases. So I am selecting it. Then uh, specify condition to identify records and set field individually. So here I am selecting case and uh, you can select case origin equals web and you need to okay that web email field is not available here so i think let me just open the setup Okay, so this is a supplied email uh, field. So let me just search it again. Yeah, here it is, supplied email, right? So if you search it with the web email label, so it won't be available. So you can just verify what is the API and basis on that you can search. And here I am putting my email address, sanjaygupta.techschool at the rate gmail.com and clicking on done. So this way my flow is created, which will run on weekly basis on like, uh, it will first run on this date and time, and then it will be uh, automatically scheduled for next seven days. So now I'm going to save this. So it is saved and now I'm just going to uh, click on activate. So as I click on activate, so what I can do, I can search for scheduled jobs. So with this option, I will be able to see whether it is scheduled or not. So here you can see it is scheduled. So update cases, lab, uh, label of the flow, then version is one because we created number uh, version number one. So version number one is scheduled right now because I activated that. 
then submitted by is my user then submitted date and time and the next schedule run is like uh, after five minutes so when it will be executed so this date time will be available in this started and next schedule run will be for 11 7 2 0 2 2 at same time right so we need to wait for five minutes so that it will be executed and then we will be checking the data if i refresh the page now so let's check whether it is executed or not so here you can see it is started and uh, executed and next schedule run is 11 7 on 10 30 pm right so after this let's check the list view so if i click on cases and select all open cases so here you can see where case origin is web uh, you can see the email is populated now one more thing uh, you need to do in your flow so here you can apply one more condition like web uh, like supplied email is null false if it is ha already having some email so in that case like we don't want to update it so if uh, origin is web and supplied email is not null is null false like if it is null then only uh, this uh, flow will work sorry here we need to put true not false so if supplied email is null and origin is web then only we need to update the records if supplied email is already there uh, it is not null then uh, we don't need to put any email address right so this way your records won't be unnecessarily uh, updated so this also you can do in your flow so this way i hope you understood like how we can schedule a flow on weekly basis